I welcome all of you in the lesson number 12 for grade two mathematics. Uh, we started the topic pattern in alphabets in our last class. And uh, what we have studied a quick overview of uh, pattern in alphabets. We have seen that how we can identify the pattern in the alphabets. The pattern in the alphabets can be made by different, uh, let, different repeating the letters. First, we check the pattern here that was A, B, C. And then again, A, B, C, then again, B, A, B, C, again, A, B, C, again, A, B, C. So that pattern was made by repeating three letters that was A, B, and C. And they were arranged in an alphabetical order. We discussed that if uh, any letters are arranged as we uh, write them in A, B, C, D form, so we can say that this, these are arranged in alphabetical order. Like uh, when you write A, B, C, D from A, B, C, uh, A to Z, so you will see A comes first, then B, then C, then D, then E. So this, uh, uh, this order is known as alphabetical order, okay? So we see that these three alphabets, A, B, C, were arranged in alphabetical order, okay? But uh, there was one more pattern we checked the example of that and that was starting with Z, Z, Y, X, Z, Y, X. So this is also the pattern made by repeating three alphabetic letters, three alphabets, Z, Y, X. But what's the difference here that these are not arranged in alphabetical order because X comes first, then Y, then Z. But here in the pattern, Z comes first, then Y, then X. So this is actually arranged by uh, Z, by repeating Z, Y, X in a reverse alphabetical order. Reverse alphabetical order means that the letter which comes in the end, we write first, then before that, which letter comes Y, then before Y, which letter comes X. And then this is done. We did some uh, practice also. I'm going to share that screen also. There was one pattern, I gave you D, E, F, D, E, and you had to find out the missing number. So you find out that was F and same here and same here. The last pattern we discussed that was about L, M, N, O. There were four alphabets um, used in that pattern. It was made by using four alphabets, L, M, and O, which are arranged in alphabetical order. So first you identify the pattern, which is the pattern, then you found out the missing number. Today we'll do some more practice and we'll do the exercise of the book as well. So are you ready to start practice? Yes. 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 Very good guys. So I'm going to give you one more pattern here and you are going to recognize that. This is PQRS. So you have to identify the pattern guys and you have to tell me what would come here, what would come here and what would come here one by one. So tell me the answer in the chat box guys. Identify this pattern, this alphabetical pattern and tell me what will come after P here. Adam very good, Muhammad Abdul Rahim very good. Saud, very good. Ayad, very good. Muhammad Farooq, very good. Yes. Adam Khaled, very good. Umar Shaheer, very good. Muhammad Abdul Rahim, very good. Ayan, very good. Mantar, very good. Khalid Abdullah, very good. Saud, very good. 
Saud and Adam, tell me answer only one time. Os, very good. All listeners need to participate, guys. Suleiman Saleh, very good. Okay, yes, sir. Let me take one of the student with me. Guys, whoever using, uh, who are not using his name, I request you to use your name so that I can recognize you. I can see someone is using iPhone name. Please change your name. Mm. Os, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, Os. Would you like to tell me what would come after P? Q. Okay, why Q? Because B Q R S B Q R S. P Q R S. Hi, yes. Okay, can you describe this pattern? Where? You will say, sir, this pattern is made by four letters P Q R S. And these letters are arranged in alphabetical order. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right, guys. This is, uh, I got to know that this is Q. Now tell me about this. After R, what should, what alphabet should be there? Yad, very good. Umar Shaheer, very good. Rafiq Samir, very good. Muhammad Farik, uh, Faru, very good. Khalid Abdullah, very good. Saud, very good. Sharif Ahmad, very good. Majid Awad, very good. Ayan, very good. Muhammad Abdul Rahim, very good. Manthar, very good. Aus, very good. Uh, Suleiman Saleh. Okay, uh, one answer is correct, but why B? Ahmad Yusuf, very good. Okay. Uh, let's take one student. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Can you tell me what will come after R? S. Well, after S, P. Okay, tell me why S? Because. Mm -hmm. Because here there are S and P. Why S and P? Yes, tell me the reason. Tell me about some pet. Tell me about this pattern. What is the pattern here? Look in the pattern. Some alphabets are repeated. Which alphabets are repeated? S and apart from P. P Q R S P. No. You will say P, Q, R, S. So these are the four alphabets which are repeated in a pattern. Right? See? P, Q, R, S, P, Q, R, S. Okay, tell me. Are these arranged in alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order? Repress. No. Reverse alphabetical order means in A, B, C, D, the letter comes at the end. You write first and you move back. But here you will see P comes first, then Q, then R, then S. So these are arranged in alphabetical order. If I write S, Q, R, P, then these are arranged in reverse alphabetical order, okay? Okay. 
Thank you. All right, guys, this is S. Now the last one. Very good, Saud. After S, which alphabet? Umar Shahir, very good. Yad, very good. Muhammad Abdul Rahim, Majid Awad, very good. Rafiq Samir, very good. Esser, very good. Ilyas, very good. Khalid Abdullah, very good. Adam, very good. Sharif Ahmad, very good. Ayan, very good. Ahmad Yusuf, very good. Os, very good. Adam Khalid, very good. Let me take my instrument. Anna Sali. Okay, very good, Ali Nizar. Anna Sali, can you hear me? Mehraj, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, Mehraj. After S, yes. which alphabet should be there? P. P. Can you tell me why? Because pattern is like that. Okay, pattern is like what? First P Q R S, mm -hmm. and again P Q R S, and again. Okay, that's very good. Thank you. So guys, you can see uh, we have identified this pattern and we have completed it by putting Q, S and P. So let me explain you about this again. If you see this pattern, so these patterns is made by four letters, P, Q, R and S. These are the letters arranged in alphabetical order in uh, A, B, C, D, P comes first, then Q, then R, then S, okay? So if you ask me to write about this pattern, so I will write, it is made by, sorry. It is made by four letters, P, Q, R, S. arranged in alphabetical order. This is, if you ask me to describe this pattern, so I will write this, that it is made by four letters, P, Q, R, S, which are arranged in alphabetical order. Same is, if you ask me to write about this, so I will write, it is made by four letters which are L comma M comma N comma O and these are also arranged in alphabetical order. Look and if you talk about this, so these are three letters. I will write here, it is made by three letters, G, H, I, which are arranged in here I will write, it is made by not four, three letters, which are the letters G, H, I. So I will write here G, comma, H, 
comma i arranged in alphabetical order in this way i can describe the pattern is that clear to you guys how can we describe the pattern very good so guys these all were arranged in alphabetical order but if i change the order like this one this is the pattern now guys can you tell me the answer here what would come after l tell me your answers in the chat box very good mohammed abdul rahim saud abdul rahim saud very good amar very good mohammed farooq very good adam khalid very good ayan very good Ahmad Al Rafai, very good. Ayad, very good. Amjad Muhammad, very good. Majid Abad, very good. Asar. Let me ask to one of you. Muhammad Al Sagir, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, Muhammad. Can you tell me what alphabet will come after L? K. Why K? Can you describe the pattern? Mm. And uh, this L and this K and this J and the, and this L and this K. now describe the pattern in that way it is made by which letters l k j it is made by three letters l k j k okay. l k j these are arranged in alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order l tell me when you write a b c d l comes first or k comes first k k comes first but here you will see k is uh, k you write after that's mean you are not writing in alphabetical order okay you are writing opposite so opposite of alphabetical order is reverse alphabetical order otherwise if you write in alphabetical order you will write j k and l and l this is alphabetical order but you write the letter which come in the uh, end in these three letters you write first l then k then j so this is reverse alphabetical order okay clear thank you okay guys not only i am uh, explaining to one of the student okay i am explaining to all of them all of you after j guys after j Ayad, very good. Majid Abad, very good. I'm going to open all of your mics, and I'm after J. What will, what letter will I I should write? L. 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 Okay, very good, very good. 
Sharif. Yes, sir. Tell me after J, what alphabet I should write? L. Why? Uh, we write L because if, uh, the the four no it it made because it made by four letters that uh, O K J O uh, O K J mm -hmm. uh, eight O K J O K J O K J. Very good. And they are arranged in, in uh, alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order? No, 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 no. It it, it change in the alpha. Alphabetical and arrange in alphabetical order. Reverse, reverse alphabetical order. Right. Yeah. That's very good. Thank right. you. Thank you. Uh, uh, yes. The, this is uh, the we do we finish? Uh, no, no. Uh, do we will do some example again, like uh, three? But uh, in in this method, we. We will write all this uh, in the notebook or leave it. It's just for example. It's just for example, okay? Yeah, for okay. question to ask yeah. question. Yes. Because to check. Uh, to we check your level. Yes, exactly. To make you practice, okay? Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay, guys. So after K, that will be. Which number I ask you? So you will tell me now this. After K, what should be there? Ten. Look at this pattern, guys. This is L K J. L K J. L K and this should be J. Okay, so this was L and this was, this is J. What is the pattern here? We will see, we will write here, it is made by three letters. Which are the three letters here? L comma K comma J. And these are arranged in reverse alphabetical order. Is it clear, guys? Clear. Yes. 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 Very good. Okay, I give you one more pattern. This is going to be a little different. Um, C, E, F. Yes, guys, tell me about this. After see what Alphabet should be there. Answer me in the chat box. Adam, very good. Yad, very good. Saud, very good. Asar, very good. Yas, very good. An Mantar, very good. Sharif, very good. Muhammad Abdurrahim, very good. Rafiq Samir, very good. Ammar, very good. Os, very good. Abdul Aziz Muhammad, very good. Ayan, very good. Miraj, very good. Muhammad Faro, very good. Ali Nizar, very good. Mashari, very good. Muhammad Said, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Yes, Muhammad Said. After C, what alphabet should be there? E. E. Why E? Mm -hmm. Because, because the E is the second letter. 
Sorry. Muhammad, I can hear a background. Uh, one of one more teaching noise from you. That's why. Omar Hassan, can you hear me? Yes. Omar Hassan, can you tell me what will come after F? C. Okay, why? Can you tell me about the pattern? What is the pattern here? Yes. Which alphabets are repeated in this pattern? S, E. C and E. E and F. F. There are three alphabets which are repeated in the pattern, okay? So you can say it is made of it is made of three letters which are C, E, and F. Now you will check: Are these arranged in alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order? Yes. Hmm. Can I close my mic? Why? What I'm saying again. I am asking, are these arranged in alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order? Like, uh, are these alphabets uh, written in the same positions as you write in A, B, C, D? <coughs> like in A, B, C, D, when you write, C comes first, then after C, when you move forward, D and then E and then E, uh, then, e then F, right? So these are arranged in alphabetical order, okay? Yes. All right. So guys, you can see here, these, this pattern is made by uh, three letters, which are C, E, and F, and these are arranged in alphabetical order. So there will be also C. And you will write here, that it is made by three letters which are C comma E comma F arranged in alphabetical order. Okay. Now if I give you one more I F D I F D Okay let make it H H F D This is the pattern, guys. Can you tell me what will be right after F? After F. Yeah, very good. Adam, very good. Mahmoud Farooq, Mantar, Ilyas. Very good. Amjad Muhammad, Asr, Oz, Muhammad Al Sagir. Very good, Ayan. Very good, Miraj. Very good, mm -hmm. Omar Hassan. Very good, Ahmad Muhammad Al Rufai. Very good, uh, yes, Iyad. You are asking to open your mic. Yeah. Okay. 
Hello. Yeah, South, because the pattern is made of three HFD. Okay, very good. Can you hear me, Ed? Elias, very good. I'm opening your mic, but I think your mic is not working. Okay. So I'm going to open your mic and you will tell me there, uh, the answer here. After F, what will come guys? D, 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 Very good guys. After F, there will be a D. Why D? Because the pattern is made by three letters, which are D, F and H. Okay guys, tell me, these are arranged in alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order? Yes. Yes, sir. I'm asking you the question. Tell me, guys, these alphabets D, F, and H are arranged in alphabetical order or reverse alphabetical order? Reverse. order. Yes. Yes. Very good. These are arranged in reverse alphabetical order because in alphabetical order, D comes first, then E, then F, and then G, and then H. So we make this pattern by skipping one of the letter and writing three letters D, F, H in reverse alphabetical order. This is the alphabetical order, D, F, H. D comes first, then F, then H. But here, you see, uh, we write D in the end, then F uh, before D we write F and before F we write H. So this is reverse alphabetical order, not alphabetical order. So we will write here about the pattern that it is made by three letters is made by three letters which are they d comma f comma h arranged in a reverse alphabetical order is that clear guys that's very good guys now you are ready for the book exercise uh, inshallah tomorrow we'll do book exercise and we'll try to complete test we'll um, go to the testing zone also thank you sharif thank you okay guys the class time is finished inshallah i'll meet you tomorrow until then, take care of yourself. Bye bye. Bye bye, 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 b